All right, guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Detroit Become Human. So, I just want to say real quickly, I am very upset because every time I launched this game, it always told me, hey, you're up, your uh, your graphics card isn't up to date on this driver's blah, blah, blah. The game might have issues. Never had any issues up until now. I've gotten past this point, by the way. My last video shows that. But now, when I launched the game today, it basically wouldn't get past this part. It got here, and then the game crashed. Had to basically update my drivers and everything like that. So now, holy shit, we're actually fucking moving again. So, let's look at this stuff. Blah, 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 blah. Now let's open up the door to the street. It's just been frustrating. I really just wanted to play this game before anyone got back home. I actually thought someone got home when I was, while I was updating my drivers. I was like, really? Turned the house out, okay. And of course, now I have to sneeze. Every fucking I start making a video, I have to sneeze. The really fun part is pressing control actually changes um, how you look. But anyway, I'm gonna have my headset on. So there's stuff in here too, that's interesting. Okay. We're gonna try uh, cleaning up a little bit more. We're not gonna report to Todd immediately. He's doing his own thing, so fuck him. the hell? Missing component. What the hell is happening out there? I, I just want to say now. Oh, he's got a head. Okay. I just want to say now. Uh, it's interesting that uh, I she's she just she just ordered a, a part for that thing. Like what? Like, am I the one that finds that kind of weird? Like, I mean, it's not crazy. It's it's a good idea, but like, I mean, how how expensive is a part like that that you can just kind of order with no issue? You see, I think most of the game is just doing that kind of stuff. So, as far as I know. Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer. Right away. <laughs> oh wait, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a lot to say about certain things in this game. Like it all just brings up interesting things. Like the fact that like he's been he's kinda of being a douche to her and she's she's just an android, like so it's like she, you know I don't know, it's just it's too weird to me. Like why why be an asshole? That's the thing. I was like, you you know why? It's because you know you gotta you gotta feel strong, right? You gotta feel strong. Uh, let's go over here real quick and pick this stuff up. I did not finished the first floor yet. What's this? It's hockey. Doesn't matter. Let's tidy this up. That's how this is. This, it's a game where you know we're in twenty was it thirty eight, and you know essentially androids are just everywhere. Like I'm actually curious how many how many androids are there to humans at this point? You know. Fuck you. Alright, so let's, uh... Let's go to the garden. I'm curious. He doesn't even realize that, we're, what, that we just left the house. Uh... Let's just roam a bit. I'm trying to play as much as I can. Just kind of enjoy the game, you know? So I don't want to just rush things and all that stuff. Oh, it looks like we actually have to do this anyway, so that's good. So we're currently just, uh, really just an android doing chores, really. Obviously, this is one of those things where, like, my, my first thought is why not hire a, a maid? Like, wouldn't they be cheaper? But obviously, android, android can do that even more, so. Yeah, we still can't, we still can't talk to her yet. So. Oh, wait, no, never mind, we can, okay. I wonder if we're gonna get in trouble immediately here, or... 
find out. Look forward. Would you like to play a game? It's not very nice out. You might catch cold. I could get you a sweater if you want. <laughs> There's a clown out here, so I'm gonna head this way. House. Yeah, it's, it just feels like it's a bit too uh, too loud right now. <clears throat> I'm curious as to. Like just does everyone just own an Android? Like, is it just? It's mostly like I wonder. Is, is it commonplace at this point, or? Red ice. Uh oh. That's not good. You shouldn't mess around with my stuff. It makes me nervous. I'm sorry, Doc. You just stay the fuck out of my business, unless you want to piss me off. Me off. No, Doc. Why, why would you put that in there then, dumbass? That was, that was my shit. Fine, we'll watch your clothes then, asshole. <laughs> Yeah, so obviously, uh... I just, I, I, I'm curious as, as to the price of a fucking Android, though, you know? Like, seriously, what, well, like... How the fuck, how the fuck does something like this, like, just... I don't know, it, it bothers me. And she's stupid something, we're gonna... I wanna, I wanna read this, what is this? All sports. Android power. Should it be outlawed? For what frenzy the latest... Uh, I, w I would say, yeah, you, you, like, this is, like, I feel like it's, like, <laughs> like, rule number one, when you build androids, you don't let them play in sports. And so, to give the season, Android pitcher X67 threw a pitch that broke the 120 mile per hour mark. The human batsman wasn't able to swing until after the ball had already reached the catcher's glove. Androids are introduced as a one-per-team innovation, but they've come to dominate team strategy. Every draft sees the major professional baseball teams breaking their own transfer records to purchase, uh, these latest Android models, but is the game suffering? Probably. Uh, Jenny Waterfield, head of Fanzine Home Run, says fans are becoming disenchanted. The magic of sport is seeing the limits of human potential. Machine breaking these kinds of records just isn't exciting or even surprising. But not everybody agrees. Christopher Lennox, a baseball pundit and ex pitcher, thinks Androids are making games more exciting. These machines are shaking things up and pushing players to do even better. The game can only survive by evolving. I, I see where they're both coming from, but yeah, it's one of those things where it's like, you you wouldn't be surprised to see an android throw a ball super fast and hard. Like that's they're they're they're, they're fucking machines. <laughs> Politics and focus. Our American center is really corrupt. China earthquake kills ten thousand people. Jesus. The transport innovation that's shaking up California. The new sub tube completed its first journey today from Manhattan to downtown LA in under two hours. Less than half the Five hour flight time. The top speed of 1800 miles per hour was made possible because the tube travels through a depressurized chamber, providing a near frictionless environment for its magnetized motors. Pretty sweet. For commuters, this raises the tantalizing prospect of finishing a long shift in the Big Apple and putting your feet up on the Golden Coast. And we're just gonna we'll just tap out of that skag bit and kind of meh. Um, is that all it was then? Yep, yeah, there's that, and then there's. Something over there as well. Just clean the shit up, man. What the fuck are you breaking already? What is this? Turn on. Oh, sorry, it's light, little guy. I feel like those are a bit more cheaper, so that's not too hard. And then she fucks with it, of course. Uh, let's see, optional tasks. So we did all that. So we just report Don. All right, fucker. What you want now? Alice, 
You better stop that right now. Why is she always pushing me? Always pushing. Yeah, that, that's 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 fantastic. Hey, uh, things are done. Can I? Hello? Can I? There we go. I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. <laughs> Out of the way, for fuck's sake! I'm sorry, Todd. It won't happen again. Oh, you can't. <laughs> they legit stop you from doing it again. <laughs> oh, that would be funny. Like, I want to see, like, would, would his reaction be the exact same, or would he actually get more pissed off because I went in front of it again? <laughs> Were you fucking broken? Uh, oh, well. Guess we'll just go upstairs. So it's just going to get a bit more interesting. What's the same? My desktop audio shows like it's very, like my voice is much louder, but my headset, this shit's, this game's loud as hell. Tidy his room. Super. Alright, we'll break this real quick. Which, I have a feeling something else is going to happen in this, this area, but I'm not going to say anything yet. Uh, I, I don't care to read about this one, honestly. Oh, oh, let me go over here. Take. And just obtain risk of behavior disorders. And a gun. Shocker. I like how it takes notice that it's unlocked. <laughs> it's like, hey, this this thing this drawer with the gun is unlocked, just just to let you know. Unlock the dialog action or oh sweet. Oh, oh, come on. Tidy. So now it's just kind of scooting around, tidying everything up. Okay. Let's actually switch that on. I'm curious. Oh, no, switch it on. Okay. Damn. President Warren spoke today at the opening of a new cyber life plant near Milwaukee. At the event, the president again praised cyber life's role in the exceptional performance of the U.S. Hmm. Okay. That's weird, but okay. So they are purposely making me do other stuff. Oh, let me check this real quick. see what it is so all right let's see what else we have just uh just this again so take Alice's room I'm not gonna read that right now Watch it. I wasn't even in the way Here's my first thought. Uh, if I. Is that it? <laughs> hold on, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, interesting. If I get the chance, I will kill this guy. Like, there's, there's no doubt about it. So they have a bathroom and a restroom. That's interesting. Sorry, to me, it's the same thing. <laughs> you generally just. There's one. So wait, what? What is that? What's different about this then? Just okay. So this just doesn't have a. Gotcha. Just a, this doesn't have a uh, a toilet in it. Dollars to it. Uh, let's see. 
Wait, does that want me to mop a floor in here? It does. What? Oh, there it is. Okay. Well, he wants me to do it. Obviously, it's there. Ooh, press that S. Ooh, yeah. Hit that S. Weird. Okay. Interesting. Like, so far, I'm, I'm, I'm literally just cleaning. I'm just doing chores. That's all I'm doing. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Oh, nice. Right, let's make the bed real quick. Wait for him to yell at me for being in here doing my job. So I'm guessing that she she knows what happened to uh to me beforehand. Oh, there we go, come on. What else there is in here? Okay. We're gonna look at this. Alice in Wonderland. Alice in Wonderland. Of course. Yeah, because her, her name is Alice. <laughs> Get it. Get it. Did you even pick it up? God, what a shitty android. Doesn't even pick it up. Come on. It's supposed to tidy. Why am I taking this? Seems very un Android like. <laughs> There's nothing to tidy there. What, what's going on? What's the point of that? Uh. Oh. We can look up here, I guess. I think we're getting pretty close to the Seems big stuff's got it. Just in case we're gonna have my headset on real quick. So the game is for sure loud, but I'll deal with it. Alright, so let's talk to her, and I'm sure I'll get yelled at for talking to her, so let's do it. Seems to be the theme here. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? Her mom's name. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. You're very quiet. I hope I don't scare you. What she just give me? A key. Uh oh. Oh, I'm not gonna like this, am I? No, if you just picked up that book, you wouldn't have to deal with this. No, we're opening this. I want to know. I'm taking my headset off, and the game is a bit loud right now. I don't know what's in here. Her mother. So I'm going to guess her dad was not always an asshole, or did he kill her? Let's see what they look like in the picture here. I wouldn't say he's super happy, but he had a family, so I'm curious is what happened to her. Yeah, she gets abused. She's not happy with him. I mean, I already knew that, so. And yep. Smacks the android around. Broke the android. I guess there was no car accident. I'm guessing it's just flat out he ripped her to shreds. So obviously I'm good. So the the red is obviously in danger. With yellow being like you know kind of slowly getting out of it, but yeah. So she knows she's in danger now. All right, so that's time for new instructions, I guess. Much so we don't want to talk to the asshole, we gotta talk to the asshole. So let's go ahead and do that. See if we can't get yelled at for more shit that we didn't do. What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. Playing. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. You think you 
dad's a low life. Mm, you are. Mm -hmm. Fucking loser. Yep. Can't get a job, take care of his family. Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. He's not even drunk yet. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! You hate me! I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. I was gonna say I didn't get anything. I was like, "What? <laughs> How did I not get anything?" Let's see. The only thing we missed one here. I think it was the book we didn't fully read. My bad. Fuck me, right? Um. Good. Good. All right. All right. November fifth, twenty thirty-eight. Okay, so it doesn't immediately go into anything crazy. Okay, that's good. Grab my poop. <laughs> Quick toaster strudels. Alright, I'm gonna assume that this is uh this is a safe spot, I hope. Um it's a bit longer of a video, which is good. This game definitely um it's going slow right now, which is good. I assume it's gonna pick up pace soon and Go crazy, so I'm excited for that. Um, see how we get the, I'll get more parts up as best I can, and I will see you guys in the next video.